Point. Meantime, we got some more pitching news. The Pirates and Mitch Keller agreeing to a five year, $77 million extension. It's the third richest contract in team history. Keller has come up in the Pirates organization. Last year, he set a franchise record for strikeouts by a right hander with 210. And remember, Garrett Cole There's was a, couple a part of names on that list. Yeah, too. Cole, I mean, AJ Burnett. And, and you know what? Give the Pirates credit because they are starting to build a foundation. And the checkbook is open for some of their core players. Brian Reynolds recently, a big deal. Key Brian Hayes, a $70 million deal. And now Mitch Keller, Dan, five years, $77 million. This guy showed some flashes of being a frontline starter. And, and this is obviously great news for the Pirates. Talking about recovery, on MLB Tonight, we were on live on his debut. He gave up, I believe, six runs in his first inning of big league, right? This buildup of a big prospect. Ended up pitching a little over four innings that day. But I'm going to tell you something. He's come back, and he's come back in a big way. He's changed some things mechanically. He's added some velocity. Good hard breaking ball. And if you're the Pirates, you have to have something to build around. Yeah. They feel that this is the guy that they're going to build their staff around moving forward. I commend them for doing it. i tell you what I like. What I like the second half of the season, they weren't afraid to run this guy out there to test the waters in the seventh inning, in the eighth inning, to have him learn how to finagle through a lineup a second and a third time because I think we have so much with starting pitchers, treated him with kid gloves, second time to the lineup, any trouble, get him out of there. If you're looking for a Garrett Cole, you're looking for Jacob DeGrom, you're looking for Framber Valdez, you've got to start letting these guys pitch and learn how to get through the lineup the third time, get to the sixth inning, get to the seventh inning. The Pirates did that last year with him. I agree with you 100 percent there. I mean, when you look at the, the extensions that they've dealt out the last uh, three years, last two yeah. years between Keller, Reynolds, Hayes, and you got, you know, Paul Skeens coming up. Yes. You can start to see, you know, you some, to for, some formation yes. of a core here with the, with the Pirates. Uh, I mean, Mitch Keller had, 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 it was an all-star last year, had a really nice season. Um, you know, by the way, I was looking, too, on our, on our research. Another name on that list, Mark Baldwin, had 197 strikeouts in 1891. Wow. Yeah. Can we get a still shot of what Mark Baldwin what he looked like, like in 1891? Wow. 18, right? I, I didn't figure they had a lot of I marks. Thought that's, I thought that I was a typo. I think they had a lot of marks in the 19th typo? century. Yeah, that's, a, that's true. Wow. So congratulations. We can get to, that head shot, right? Yeah, Ooh, let's, we, can, we can work on let's that. Let's work too. on that research. <laughs> yeah. we got a lot of tape segments, so we can get it going during those.